main group reactions, and this is for the metals in main group, generally follow this principle, where the metal will add to something. It could either be like diatomic ZZ, or it could be a, like a WZ, but it'll add to the negative part, the anionic part, and this will oxidize to form MZ. Okay, so it's an oxidation for the metal. Uh, <coughs> this compound at the end is ionic. So how you figure out what it looks like is you need to know the charge of M and Z, and you put them together. For example, if it was aluminum and oxygen, aluminum is plus 3, oxygen is minus 2, so it would be Al2O3. Okay? Uh, and then you would balance it. That's the general reaction. I've got a bunch of specifics. Not every main group metal will follow this reaction. Some will do it differently, but in general, this was the best way I could find to summarize the infinitely ridiculous amounts of reactions in that chapter. Okay? So, the first ones. Uh, metal plus H2, and this, uh, you want to think of the H minus as the anion, so we'll make MH. And you've got to figure out what the subscripts are, so that depends on the problem in the metal. Uh, but this is from H minus. You can have plus O2. If you plus O2, you're adding the oxygen. And you think O2 minus. Uh, so uh, MO, and you've got to figure out what X and Y is what the subscripts are. Again, it's ionic. Same thing for water. Water is H plus and OH minus. So we got to add OH minus. Whenever you see water, it's going to add OH minus. M, OH. Uh, and then this will have its negative 1, so it'll be a 1 here. But you got to figure out what that is. Uh, what else can we add? We can, uh, oh, sometimes uh, this will have plus H2 here. What's going to happen is, occasionally, you can't account for all your atoms. When you can't account for all your atoms, you've got to add another product. No matter how you try to balance it, it just doesn't work. So you add another product, if there's extra hydrogens, that comes off as H2. So let me make a little table over here. Uh, accounting, I guess I'll call it. Accounting. It, it, oh, okay, talk to you. If there's extra H, you've got to write H2 in the products. If there's extra NH3, extra, I should say nitrogen, you write NH3 in the products. If there's extra carbon, oops, oh, sorry, there's another one. Okay, then it's CH4 in the products. Okay? So we'll see the other ones in just a second. So far we've just seen H2. Okay, plus X2. X stands for halogens. This will go to Mx, think X minus. Uh, so we'll have some subscript there. You can also happen with N2. Plus N2 goes to M, uh, and N has a 3 minus charge. So like that. And then this one has an additional reaction that can happen. Uh, with H2O, H2O, we're adding OH minus, just like before. So it's MOHX. And again, here you're going to have extra nitrogens. So, so, like I said before, extra nitrogens come off as NH3. It comes off as the hydrated, I should say hydrated, the hydrogen form of it, I guess. Uh, the best word I can think of right now. And then one more reaction. Uh, it's a little different. You're starting with something with carbon in it, M, C, X, Y, uh, plus water, again, goes to M, uh, O, H, plus, in this case, C, H, 4, because you've got to count for the carbons, so you come off the C, H, 4. Is that cool? Okay, just one other thing to say. Oh, I think I might have missed. I don't know if I uh, wrote this. Oh, did I erase it? I, I did erase it, but I'll, I'll add it down here. Uh, also, if you have MO, so metal oxide, you can add water to make the metal hydroxide. Okay, so whatever it is, metal oxide, a metal carbide, a metal nitride, you add water, it goes to the metal hydroxide. Okay. 
You also don't want to ever forget uh, the oxidation combustion type reactions. You add oxygen. Uh, that's a really common reaction. You also don't want to forget single replacement. And I mentioned single replacement. Many of these metal reactions that occur, and I haven't written any here but from previous 2A classes, single replacement is a really common reaction for metals. And that's when you have an ionic and something by itself, and the anion goes to the other one. Okay. So, anyways, these are the ones I, the new ones for you. There's the summary. Let's try some examples. Okay, I just taped myself a raisin. I don't know. 